they're, they're gonna do some house cleaning right now. A little trash and you know, something like that. Just do a little house cleaning here. If I get the old lady to do it, but I don't have one, so uh, maybe I should get one. At least uh, an overnight one, you know. <laughs> anyway, good morning, Double R Radio. Emilia Nevada, south of the border. There we go. I'll never forget the song. Always reminds me back in my uh, prom night when I told a girl, where would you like me to get you? And she told me, south of the border. I said, all right, no problem. And there we go. <laughs> well, kind of, sort of, you know, just kind of like that. Anyways, where are we at? Um... 8.13 in the morning, good morning, Double R Radio, April the 4th. Those me, there's, you know, a little moquito. Hang on. I used to get a kick, man, back in junior high, high school, you get a little moquito. Oh, they come on. So get ready. Lift off. Pew! And then take off line, and they probably land on some girl's hair or something like that. That's fine. I miss doing that. <laughs> Here we go. Let's go live. There we go, the late, great Emilio Nevada, south of the border. Good morning, Double R Radio, Thursday morning, Tejano Thursday it is. Do not forget at 9 o'clock this morning, Spotlight, Artist of the Morning Show, The Hometown Boys, sponsored by Handyman Edward Castillo. I can't see him, and several people have told me, Robert, Robert, Handyman Edward Castillo. Um, is he, uh, is that kind of like, uh, is he flirting around with the women, trying to say Handyman? Uh, no, no, Edward's not like that. Uh-uh, Edward's a Bible-reading handyman. He's a real full-fledged handyman. If you're looking for a handyman, Edward Castillo, you know, he uh, he nails it, he sheet rocks it, he replaces it, he does all that stuff. There you go. So look, at handyman Edward Castillo, get a hold of him. Uh, do I have his number? I got it somewhere around here. <laughs> I got his number somewhere. Let me see if I can find Edward's. Handyman number here, man. It's, I'm, just, <laughs> I'm talking about one of one of my sponsors here, and I don't have his phone number. I know he had gotten disconnected about two weeks ago, and uh, I told him that's what you get. I work for drinking all those mixed drinks with umbrellas on them, Edward Castillo. Let me see here. But I'm going to just to get handyman Edward Castillo's number. There we go. Handyman Edward Castillo. Awesome work. Reasonable rates. Free quotes. Reliable. He is reliable. Uh, call 210-300-1800. Hey man, write this baby down. Handyman Edward Castillo. 210-300-1800. Really man, he takes care of business. He's a really, really good handyman. Give him a call. You got something going on around the house. You got a half fixed. He'll take care of it. He really, really will. Anyway, good morning, Double R Radio. Uh, Thursday morning. Um, let's do some good morning shout outs. Here we go. Don't want to miss anybody. Good morning shout out. Good out to este. DJ Jerry Lasco. Good morning, brother. There we go. La Coyota. Patty Sanchez. Good morning. How are we doing from H Town, Houston? To, um, I'm probably going to go to Houston really, really soon. I want to go see the Astros, man. I'm a big Astros fan. So, look, I'm, I'm, I need to go to Houston. Got to go party with the buddies over there and catch a couple of games and all this other good stuff. So, look, I definitely need to get to Houston, Texas. Good morning, La Coyota. Primo, uh, Mr. Dan Levis. Good morning, Dan. How are we doing, Primo? There we go. It's the Rosemary Gomez, San Antonio, Texas, by way of Odessa, Texas. Good morning, Rosemary. Michelle Cohen. Uh, Michelle lives up here in... Uh, between San Antonio and Austin, uh, Buda, if I got that right, Buda, Texas, there we go, good morning, Michelle, how we doing, there we go, Marianne Jordan, good morning, good morning, good morning, uh, don't want to miss anybody here, Grace Rodriguez, good morning, good morning, Joey Rodriguez, good morning, Joey, how we doing, oh, hey, Joey, um, I passed by the old tea town uh, this past weekend, it's called Club Diamante, I didn't know it had closed down, dude, Club Diamante closed down, huh? Crazy, it really, really is. Good morning, shout out, Michelle Acosta. Buenos dias, Double R Radio, Thursday morning, 9 o'clock this morning. We're putting the spotlight on the hometown boys. It's the uh, compliments of sponsor Edward Castillo. Let's see what's going on out here, man, in this crazy, crazy world. Uh, let's get over here first. Uh, Uber, Lyft have uh, released some tips, some safety tips. If you're ever going to be uh, using Uber, Lyft, um, here are some things that you should be doing to be careful. Now, um, I'm trying. What I'm trying to get at here was recently a woman, a young, a young woman, was out there doing her party and doing her thing. She called an Uber. When she went outside, she thought her Uber was there. She got in the wrong car, and lo and behold, um, unfortunately, she was killed by a complete stranger who had nothing to do with Uber Lyft. You got to be careful, man. Now, mind you, I'm an Uber driver, so I'm a Lyft driver too. But you know, I put the spotlight on Uber. 
I'm an Uber driver, and really, you got to be careful. I know, I think it's simply awesome when I'm when I'm headed to go pick up somebody. When I get there, the person's looking at their phone. They're looking at me. They're looking at their phone. They're looking at me. They're looking at the license plate. They're, they're looking at me. And they, that's the way you should do it. you got to be careful, especially the women, no doubt. Here are some facts about some fun facts that you should try doing if ever you request an Uber Lyft. One, request and wait for your ride inside so as to avoid spending unnecessary time outside. Also, ensure you get in the right car with the right driver. Now, let me tell you what I do. Whenever somebody's coming to my car, whatever name I show on the app, I go, Hey, Jorge, is that you, Jorge? Jorge, carnal, I'm Jorge. Okay, well, I'm Robert. Get in the car. Vamanos. And there you go. Got to play it that way, man. You got to be saved. There we go. Also, it says that passengers, if possible, should ride in the back seat so you can get out on either side of the doors if you need to get out. There you go. Really, man, and that's good stuff. Michelle Acosta, good morning. Joey Lusing is good morning. Grace Lusing is good morning. Monica Correal is good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Marianne Jordan, good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Um, let's see what else is going on. Um, a driver was arrested here in San Antonio at the AT&T parking lot like about an hour after the Spurs game. Uh, why? Because he was doing donuts on the parking lot. First, when I read this, I, said, I thought it said he was making donuts. I said, why would you arrest somebody for making donuts in the parking lot? But no, he wasn't making donuts. He was doing donuts in the parking lot. There you go. Cops asked him, why'd you do it? He said, I was hungry. And there you go. Well, he was, he was hungry, so he was making donuts. Also, check this out. Whataburger is now doing Dr. Pepper uh, milkshakes. How crazy is that, right? Dr. Pepper milkshakes. So anyways, if, if you want a soda, you want some ice cream, go to Whataburger, you get the best of both worlds. A Dr. Pepper and a milkshake. You know, you would think that uh, they would make Big Red. I love Big Red, man. Big Red milkshakes, man. That would be awesome. It really, really would. So look, there you go. Whataburger is releasing Dr. Pepper milkshakes. And last but not least, Stripes. The convenience store that you don't see here in San Antonio, well, you'll see some here, but you'll see a whole lot of them um, out there in Corpus Christi. Well, they've uh, released the final edition, 2019 Selena Cup for Fiesta de la Flor. I have one of them right here, look. See, this is my Selena Cup right here. This is my Selena Cup. This is what they gave me, my Selena Cup. Um, I'm not really too big into this. You know, if I don't get the other ones, it, it's no big deal. But there you go. Stripes is releasing their final edition of the Selena Edition Cups. Um, it's going to be uh, happening Saturday, April 6th at 10 a.m. And supplies will be there while they last. So there you have it. Perla Milano, good morning, good morning, good morning. Double R Radio T, what it is Thursday morning. How no Thursday it is. Let's get it going. Let's get by Jesse Gonzalez. Uh, 821 in the morning, 9 o'clock this morning. The Spotlight Artist of the Morning Show. Oh, yeah. The Hometown Boys. Good morning. There we go. Let's get to the morning show. Join me right now. Deborah Camarillo, sponsor Double R Radio. Join me right now. Robert Just click on the blue button. You'll be joining me live. Tejano Thursday. Orale.